In the modern business world, many if not most companies live and die by the internet. Even brick and mortar stores rely heavily upon online advertising and marketing. If a company's servers are unreachable to consumers, their profits will suffer heavily. To give a recent example, a denial of service or a DOS attack against the UK lottery this September left it inaccessible for 90 minutes during peak hours. Big e-commerce companies such as Amazon or Walmart would lose well over $5 million if their website was down for that much time. Smaller businesses would have an even tougher time getting their site back up and would also be at risk of permanently losing their customers to larger competitors. With the ever-increasing frequency of DOS attacks, companies need a way to monitor their servers and keep their operations running smoothly. To do so, companies must be able to pinpoint the exact cause of any issues that arise and fix them as quickly as possible. Nixon is the only solution that seamlessly integrates cybersecurity with performance monitoring, ensuring your company does not have a blind spot in your infrastructure that hackers will inevitably exploit. Let's go through a recreation of a real live attack on one of Nixon's customers, where a Nixon net detector was used to detect and then mitigate a denial of service incident within minutes. First off, let's look at the setup that this customer had. The right hand side of this diagram shows the enterprise, a large e-commerce retailer with a load balancer managing traffic between its multiple servers. These are protected by a web application firewall or WAF and monitored by a Nixon unit. Note the load balancer at the gateway. This will modify incoming IP addresses before they ever reach the WAFs or the website. This presented a problem to the customer. How could they ever track down the source of an attack against their site when the attacker's IP address changed before they ever reached it? After facing a similar attack in the past and spending weeks trying to determine the originating IP address, they turned to Nixon. Unlike most other security tools, Nixon captures all originating IP addresses and all of their activity with 100% accuracy. In fact, this feature was one of the most important when the Secret Service used Nixon in the largest investigation of its type to take down an international organization consisting of 28 different entities in 6 different countries. Rick, a network analyst for the aforementioned e-commerce retailer, has been tasked with figuring out why customers have been complaining about slow response times on their website. After struggling to determine root cause with log and flow-based tools in the past, this company recently deployed a Nixon net detector to help diagnose and solve such issues. Here, we see Rick's customer report called Web Incident Response, a hybrid security and performance report to monitor server connections and detect potentially dangerous activity. As soon as he enters the Nixon unit, Rick immediately sees critical alarms on the event's timeline within the last hour or so. These present the greatest potential threat. On the very same screen, Rick notices the event style, which tags the critical alerts as slow application server and the severe ones as file extension mismatch. Without a single click within his report, Rick immediately knows this is a major cybersecurity threat. He chooses the first critical alarm and clicks drill. This zooms him in on only the data that triggered this event, narrowing down the investigation so Rick can find where the issue occurred. Here, Rick looks at the web sessions tile to see what caused his slow server. After sorting on the transaction latency column, Rick immediately notices an anomaly. One session took around 40 seconds, which is visibly much longer than the others. The neighboring column shows that this particular session was a post request, while the others were all get requests. In other words, the normal sessions are just browsing sessions, where for the anomalous session, information was submitted to the site. After just one click, Rick immediately knows what happened. Someone uploaded something to his server which caused it to crash. Rick now drills on path to investigate the how and the who. The application sessions tile gives Rick the answers he was looking for. Two clicks in, Rick now sees precisely what actions this user performed to determine how the site was brought down. He looks for the session with the post request, since that had the largest latency, and notices that it caused a couple of alerts to fire off, including the file type mismatches he saw earlier that flagged a PDF as an executable file. In fact, he can see in the session details that a PDF was indeed sent to the web server. The detected content indicator lists the file as application DOS exec. In plain terms, this is not a PDF, but an executable file in disguise. With one last click, Rick reconstructs this session to examine the file that was sent to the site. He sees everything this particular user sent to the website, their name, their email address, and their disguised file. Because he is using Nixon, Rick is now able to quickly go back in time and find any other instances of the malware on his network and who sent them. 
Using Nixon's breadcrumbs up at the top, he easily navigates through his previous steps back to the beginning. From the search bar, he types in file name mystatement.pdf to search for it across all traffic to the site. Notably, Nixon records this traffic at record-breaking speeds and does not lose a single packet of data. Now, he looks at the originating IPs tile. Here, he sees that there were three different IPs that sent the malicious file. These are all original IP addresses before the load balancer changed them, meaning Rick has identified the actual sources of the attack. If we scroll down to application sessions, we can indeed see that all three sessions involve sending the malicious file to our website. These IPs had clearly tried to remain undetected. Of course, because Rick had a Nixon, there is no such thing as undetected on this network anymore. Rick now simply sends a report of everything he did to his engineering and IT teams using Nixon's export functionality. They can now fix this vulnerability in the code and blacklist the originating IPs that were involved in this attack. Application-based DOS attacks such as this take very long to detect as the attack usually involves a single bad file in a vast sea of data. However, Nixon's unique searchable security camera with robust alarms for your cyber infrastructure makes it quick and easy. If you would like to learn more or want to schedule a demo to see how Nixon's products can help you with your most important threats, contact us today at info@nixon.com. Thanks for watching.